Greetings, everyone! It's me, Ganeshva, from Blood and Pictures, and welcome to a different... Well, first of all, a video that... A thing I haven't done in a long time. But again, April was charity month and stuff like that. But I have heard of something and I wanted to make a video about it. Which is... Pregnancy Craving Burgers. Now, hear me out. Apparently, there's a, st um, a certain fast food chain that I will no name that um, decided in Germany, you know what? For Mother's Day, we're going to make a special little thing. And the special thing is that they basically took inspiration from a lot of women. They said, like, what their, like, most prominent cravings are during pregnancy. Like, those weird things, like, uh, I can't think of a good example on top of my head, even though I made the burgers. Basically, like, pickles and chocolate and weird things like that. And I was like, oh, well, some of these combinations do sound interesting and, like, something that is, like, worth trying out. However, they only give them out for pregnant women and they give them out for free, but no one else is able to get them. Which is a bother, but oh, but oh well, what are you gonna do? Make them yourself! What I did! And I basically just cooked them, and like, made them, there's a couple of them, but I picked four, and I made three, because I couldn't make the fourth one. The first one, is bratwurst with Nutella, which is like, a bratwurst is like a, a German sausage that you f um, grill, or that you like barbecue, basically. And then there is fries with ice cream. I did ch make a little change to that because I couldn't find a good, um, like a good worthwhile package of uh, strawberry ice cream, which is the one on the burger. I use vanilla instead. And then there's also fried eggs and banana. All of these sound really weird and really out there. However, I made them. Basically what I did, I had to, because I couldn't find the recipe online, to be fair, I didn't look that long. I basically looked at the images of the burgers and tried to, okay, what's usually in a burger and what is seen on this burger or not seen on this burger, and then just combine and combine like it based off of that. Which I then did, and then I tasted them, and I'll show you how I did that. So um the recording crashed. I'm very mad about that. Um I'm gonna do the intro and the introduction, all of that good stuff later. For now, I'm gonna actually try out these weird burgers that I've done an intro about. Oh my goodness, I did not, oh no, oh no. But let's start with the one I find the weirdest first, which is the banana egg one, which is now all slimy. Mm. You know, tasting the banana in there is kind of odd, but it works. It kind of works. I have the egg yolk everywhere. Like, oh my goodness. I'm probably a mess. I can't even see myself. But yeah, it kind of works. I'm not gonna lie, this is... Mm. The sweetness of the banana is very odd. Not something you expect, but apart from that, it's a dry burger. It's kind of flavorless. That's very interesting. I, I thought that one would be not as good. I, this one was the one I dreaded the most, I think from those are gonna try. Next up, the one I um, am looking forward to the most, which is this Nutella mess. Nutella and bratwurst. So, 
I'm going to eat both, but I want to try this one now. Mmm. Not bad at all. And the custard and the Nutella are not mixing well. Um, was it custard? The yellow hearty stuff you put on your burgers and stuff. It doesn't mix well. But apart from that, I'm kind of into it. Maybe leave away the custard and I'm actually into it and maybe put the Nutella on the inside instead. Yeah! That's actually real nice. I will eat both. I'm sorry that I'm covering up my beard, but I'm, I have like... I have like the entire food pyramid in my beard right now. Okay, so I had to shave off a bit of my beard because it was all in the food and was too long. But like, again, the Nutella's on the wrong side. Apart from that, Mm. And apart from that, just leave away the custard, and you're good. Yeah, this one, really good. Either leave away the Nutella, or the custard. And then it's great. So, weirdly enough, I did not expect this. But from the Nutella and the banana one, I think the banana one's my favorite out of these two. There will be a follow-up with one. additional burgers, the fries and ice cream one. Well, here is the third and last burger. Sadly, I can't make the cake one, which is fries with vanilla ice cream. I know on the picture it says um, strawberry ice cream, but I couldn't afford the only batch of ice cream they, uh, the only batch of that ice cream they had, sadly. So, here it is. While I'm getting a call. Great. This one, I'm most excited for, because this one actually sounds a lot like something really edible, like something that, like, a combination of fries and ice cream is already a thing that happens. So let's see. Huh. You barely notice the ice cream. That's interesting. Let me put on some more. Let me put on just like a huge chunk of more. Hmm. I don't know how much different it would be with with strawberry ice cream because it doesn't taste that much. Like this is really good. I wouldn't make this just like that. I would have to try and combine a normal McDonald's burger with fries and ice cream. Hmm. This is amazing. But it's actually really good. So there you have it. Those burgers are oddly delicious. Oddly enough, very edible, if not delicious, in fact. This one's my favorite, the ice cream fries one. And there you have it. Again, weirdly enough, the, the one I expected to work the best was the worst. But all of them were edible. All of them were like, I actually finished all of them. And I personally will make at least once, if not more times again, the ice cream one, because that one was my favorite among them all. The banana one wasn't so bad as well. I mean, it, like, the banana goes weirdly well, and I had heard from friends that uh, French cuisine actually featured a lot of bananas in hearty meals. 
So my and like on the bottom line, those are burgers worth trying at least. And you're get you'll if you are German in Berlin and heard of it, you'll you can get them for free. However, since I'm not sponsored and not anything, this is not sponsored, not all, not at all. Which is why I'm not even saying which like brand it is, which uh, restaurant it is. Um, also because I personally have a quail against that restaurant for completely different reasons. But that's besides the point. Anyway, I hope, um, you enjoyed me trying extremely weird <laughs> pregnancy craving burgers. <laughs> and finding out some of them are actually pretty good. So, for now, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like. That would be greatly appreciated. And I'll see all of you after you check out the links in the description below in the next video in the stream. Cheerio!